All right, so in this pro in this video, we are looking at uh, finding the volume of spheres now. So uh, if we look back at our uh, formula chart, we see volume of a sphere is V equals one fourth pi r cubed. All right, so let's go ahead and work a couple of these problems real quick. So first step we do, write our formula, V equals four thirds pi r cubed. And just to verify, I wrote it correctly. Doesn't hurt to look back and help and check. Four thirds pi r cubed, okay? So now I'm going to take this and plug in my radius. So I've got volume equals four thirds pi. The radius here is 10. And then I do cubed. Okay, so now that I have that, I just take that and plug it straight into Desmos. So over to Desmos. We say volume <coughs> equals four thirds. I tap to the right, pi 10 was our radius, and then to get the cubed, I press this button here, and then type in a 3, and this gives me my volume here. Alright, so the volume equals 4188.79. And then I use my inches, and those are cubed. Because for volume, my unit is always going to be cubed. All right, so now we can do a similar problem here. Uh, but we'll do this one with Desmos. So just looking at it right quick here, looks like I have the diameter. Uh, remember for my volume formula, I need radius. So that means I've got to take that diameter and cut it in half. So I'm just looking at that one side, the radius. Uh, so if I take 10 and cut it in half, that's going to be 5 centimeters on this side, 5 centimeters on this side. So my radius equals 5 centimeters. I write my formula. Oops. Pi r cubed. I take that. And really, we still have the same formula here. I can just show you that you can do it this way, where we have pi r cubed. And we say r equals 5 and it goes ahead and gives me that volume. So my volume would be 523.598, so we'll round that to 0 0.60. So volume equals 523.60 centimeters cubed.